Oh, I tied me a bunch of, a bunch of spidery type flies. Yeah, them bad boys. All I'm doing is I'm perfecting my tying method. Basically just trimming down what I do with the steps of it and, and the order of things. To make a quicker fly and a better fly. I'm good to go now. Got another nice little rain shower this morning. Passed through real quick, but you can see there's a little bit of water getting into the pond. That's good. It needs a bunch. We're just gonna start right here. That sky's clear back that way. It's pretty. Let's just start right here. Right, we're just going to start with a plain old yellow one. Ain't nothing special about this one. Whoa. Just trying to get back in the grass. Just a plain old yellow. Come on, focus. There you go. Nothing special about that. Got an extra leg. Oh, damn near made a career out of tying that thing on. Okay, here we go. Let's see what the fish think about my fly. Finally, it's in the water. That's a smaller version. That's a 10, size 10 streamer hook. Sits nice and high in the water. Oh, look at that. That's a bass. Oh, he slipped it. All right, they're going to be... They're going to be biting tonight. Boom, there he is. That little bass. Here comes Lucky. Here comes Lucky. Yep. Oh, dog. Man, he almost got that fish. He almost got that fish. Hold on, fish. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There you go. Boom. Oh, I missed him. Yeah, they like this one. You know, it's a little smaller than the other ones. It's built just a little different. I did a little better job of putting it together. Boom. <laughs> oh, that's such fun. Lucky, leave him alone. <laughs> I'm probably going to have a hard time keeping it away from these little bass. Good fish, huh? Bass really going after this fly. Let me pull one in from way over there by the frog. I'll try to catch that frog. He'd probably take a whack at it. Come on, Ben. Better than that. There you go. Oh! <laughs> that was a fish. <laughs> I'm trying to catch the frog and I end up getting a right on a fish. All right, I got some weeds on there now. Let me clear that weeds off. There we go. Boy, that's a good fly when they pounce on it every time you throw it in the water. All right, come on, Ben, get closer to the frog. Boom, right next to him. I uh, picked up weeds. Golly, I'm about ready to hit that frog. <laughs> that time the bass got it. <laughs> oh, that's so fun. <laughs> Fishing for frogs, and now I catch a bass, and he dove down the weeds. Come on out of there. He'll stop fighting if he gets completely covered. If his head gets covered, he'll quit fighting. Lucky. Lucky, leave that fish alone. I think he just left me. He did. He left me with nothing but a big pile of weeds. Look at that. <laughs> well, I saw it. It wasn't a very big one. Let's do it one more time right there. Here he comes. Here he comes. Here he comes. Oh, look at this whopper. <laughs> oh, he let loose, thank goodness. <laughs> oh, that's so much fun. These are small bass, but they're a hoot. 
I'll bet you that frog will hit this thing if I get it close enough to him. <laughs> I got him. <laughs> I got a bunch of weeds. <laughs> you see that? Boy, I put it right on that frog. All I got was weeds. All I got was a big wad of weeds. See where that frog comes back up. What are you finding, Lucky? Huh? What are you finding? Frogs? Yeah, probably. Way out there. <laughs> I was just casting it out to get it in position to move. Sunfish! <laughs> Lucky, get out of my line. Get out of my line, boy. Oh, Lucky, <laughs> you're in my line, buddy. Oh, Lucky, you're a nut. You're a nut, dog. You're a nutcase. Read. Oh, got a fish. <laughs> I do have a fish. <laughs> oh, he let loose. <laughs> I was playing around, <laughs> looking at too many other things. I tell you what, all you got to do is throw that thing out there in a likely looking spot and just let it sit. Something will come up and hit it. I'm used to dealing with bass more than sunfish and oftentimes, you know, bass just hit on reflex, complete reflex. If it's moving and they think it's getting away and they think it's something to eat, they're going to slam it. Sunfish tend to be a little different from my experience. They don't, they're not so pursuit oriented, you know, they don't, I think they kind of sit and wait for their food to show up. Oh, there's a bass down there. But I'd do really good if I didn't have uh, Lucky running interference for me. <laughs> Oop, there's one taking a look at it. There's always a bass over here by this corner. See if we can't get one. Pick it up. Come on, Lucky. That's a good boy. Came right to me. Come on, we'll see if we can't get a bass out of that mess. It's almost always in there. Oh my God, look at this. Poop everywhere. Nasty poop. That's that green grass getting them cows. Give them the squirts. Watch it. I don't want to drag that thing too far back. It's only four pound test. It won't take too much abuse. Boom, there he is. That acts like a bass. And there comes Lucky. He's going to try to get that fish. That one's got a little better size to him. Still not a big one, and definitely a thin fish. Oh, Lucky. God dang it, dog quit. Yeah, we got too many bass in here. They're already starting to look poor. I need to pull all, dang near everyone I can catch out of here. Yep, transport them to somebody else's pond. I got a friend that would like about two dozen of them, and I think that's about the number we need to pull out of here. Be better for the whole pond. There you go. That's fighting like a sunfish. Not a particularly big sunfish. You're getting bigger by the minute. Whoop. Nice sunfish. I'll be taking some of these things and eating them for breakfast. There you go. A bass, but yeah, that's what it is. It's a bass. It's a bass. Pulled him out of the dark side. All right, bassy, bassy. There you go. Long and thin. Got a bigger belly on him, though. Like he just had a meal. All right, goodbye. Thanks for coming. See you next time. Maybe.
fly is getting saturated, it's not floating quite as high in the water as it was. Put that one up off the dark side over here. Oh, boy, they're really popping it too. They are on it. I've had a pretty good trip this time. Spent a little too much time tying flies, especially since the one I'm using is the first one I tied. <laughs> or I tied four more, tweaking the pattern a little bit each time. I think I've got the tie down now. I can do it pretty quick. And it's, it's nice and easy. I think I'm going to make one more change. There you go. Oh, come on, fish. Try it again. I dare you. Come on. Try it again. Free meal. Oh, you tried again. Didn't get a hold of it, though. Running out of chances, fish. Running out of chances. Give you one more try. One more shot at it, and then I'm going in. Matter of fact, I'm reeling it up right now, fish. I'm reeling it up. It's reeled up. If you don't get it, you're going to have to wait till tomorrow. Or maybe the next day. I see one fish rolled way out there. I mean, one long cast so I can get my line straightened out. Get out that far. What the heck's going on here? I got a fish. What the heck is going on here? I got a fish. <laughs> that must be a tiny one. It is a tiny one. Well, that's how you end this. Oh, is that a crappie? No, it's a little. Just a little sunfish. I know you can't hardly see nothing. He's so small, I couldn't even tell I had him on there. But there we go. Goodbye, little fishy. Thanks for coming. Now let's wrap this thing up and take it to the house. Come on, Lucky, let's go home. Let's go to the house. Leave the night to the critters. Oh, that's a beautiful picture, isn't it? A beautiful picture. That old mockingbird giving that caracara hell get him. Boy, that's a handsome bird, isn't it? Kind of neat looking.